Hi Taurus, it's Leslie with just some thoughts for you for June. Some d different thoughts and I will do some through the month. But I know this is a good one for you Taurus because this is a special month for you. The placement of Jupiter, um, even though it's in Gemini, is good for you. The way the whole thing works out is very, very good for you. Um, it's This is one of the first months in a long time that you've had love. Love is love is coming for you. It's really, and you haven't had that for quite a while. I know you have had, you may have had it, but you haven't accepted it. And this is the time for you to accept it, um, for good things to happen for you. In fact, for the next oh, three months for sure, two two and a half three months, good opportunity. As soon as uh, as soon as June turns the corner, you know, as I said, Turker, uh, Jupiter is in Gemini now, but the way that's is into your your nodes and so forth that really it's helpful to you it means things will be better for you easier to do um not you won't be feeling so um oh i guess you won't be feeling so much like it's such a hard time such a hard time i'm putting cards down so we can see for your Taurus. but it's a wonderful time this is the one uh, from your from your from the month ahead for you i'm going to put more cards on that too because you um from the month ahead, you have a lot, you have love coming, and it, it's the best ever you can do. If you're doing something with someone that you're with or know, of, if they're moving in with you, if you're uh, buying something together for investment, it's a wonderful time to do that. Uh, in fact, if you're thinking about any cosmetic surgery of any kind, this is a month to do it. In fact, uh, you could give us a call and we could tell you some of the best days for you. Um, because June and July are good, good times to do that for you. Not that you need cosmetic surgery, you don't get me wrong. I just need if you're playing on or some other kind of change for yourself. This is the month to do it. Um, you've really been thinking about what to do, what to do. And I know this is in the past, this is now, because this is for June. Um, the Knight of Wands comes up, and as I, as I always say that's symbolic. You know, it could be a man or a woman. Um, and wants things to get along. Really wants to maybe get back with someone. I uh, let's see what else the cards say. Someone they knew a long time ago, or quite a while ago. And they're really thinking: Should they do this? Should they do it? They have two very, very good friends that care about helping them. Um, it, it you should do it this month. It would be a good month to do it. You're standing up for yourself. Always like him. He's a wounded warrior, but he always stands up for himself and he, he goes forward again, always. And this is a month for you to go forward on something you've been trying to do for quite a long time. And as you're trying to figure out if you should, which, which way you should go, one way or the other, uh, you will trust in the Lord. He will he'll direct your ways for you if you just trust in him. Don't take it back. You'll do the right thing here. I do feel really a person, a person in your life that's in your life that you've known for a long time or a new person, but I think this is a person you can trust, and it's very, very kind uh, and uh, a lot of integrity for you. That they will, they won't do anything intentionally to hurt you. Here's the Empress. She's um, she's you in this, uh, whether man or woman. She has the integrity to know that um, this is for both of you. You both need companions. You both would like to have a companion and a, and a love in your life and um, and this is the month to do it very much so you have all the all all the things that show me that here you have uh, maybe this is someone you are not getting along with so it could be someone from the past that you did get along with very well and you really liked had a lot of the same things a lot of good conversations uh, right now you feel that isn't going well it will get better but you need to make the first move and and you need to touch reach out you need to reach out and then it will come in your favor. As you see, justice is in your favor and will make things work very, very well for you. Here's your um, angel card. An angel card for you. Whoops. Let's see. It is the angel of transformation. And this is good for you. This is a wonderful card for you, this one. I'm aware of the divine energy that moves me and my being and transform me into who I truly am. And you'll be yourself. You'll be yourself this time. Um, so have a wonderful month. Bye-bye.